So welcome back lovely this Pokemon show being some Pokemon Go Nest for you. So guys today is July 24th Sunday the very last day of the Pokemon Go Fest Seattle. So if you are a ticket holder you are getting various experiences like new special researches, crazy wild spawns and the debut of new Ultra Beast Pokemon and two new shiny debuts but what about the non-ticket holders? Aren't they get anything for the Pokemon Go Fest celebration? That's why we're going to cover that in today's video. So, guys, without any further ado, let's get started. So, trainers, if you're a non-ticket holder like me, the first thing you have to do is to open your Pokemon Go app and head towards the today's view of the app. So, there you will see the global challenge arena. So, guys, so all trainers have to participate globally to complete this one, and we are almost here to complete and unlock the ultra bonus which we are getting during the upcoming Huzuin event the info about that will be uploading soon on my channel so when you quickly scroll down to the bottom in the today's view you will see a Pokemon Go Fest Seattle Oasis Habitat Challenge a mini challenge for the global players you cannot participate in the Go Fest so all you have to do is to catch Slowpoke Kingler, Staryu Quillfish, Mantine and Clample and we will get a special reward so in the meantime we have successfully completed all the cash requirements so now it's time to claim our rewards so trainer special is completed and we get 1022 stardust to pin up berry and a mysterious pokemon has appeared let's check what it is so trainer it's a wild fan power has appeared it's cp c21 let's quickly feed him Pina Barrel to get extra candy if you are missing out of the Pokedex entry so be sure to complete this collection challenge in the given time until 8 pm local time so you can register this regional Pokemon in your Pokedex so guys we successfully made a throw and we have successfully catched the Penpole let's check its IV it's a 3 star Penpole so trainers we successfully unlocked the ultra unlock bonus which is double raid XP so be sure to do some raid of level 5 raid boss and get some double xp without using lucky egg and so so trainer this is all for today's video it's now time to wrap our video here so guys we successfully unlocked the ultra unlock bonus for the upcoming history event so how was your excitement let me know in the comments down below also let me know so what are your guess regarding the upcoming raid day coming soon to Pokemon Go so guys with that being said thank you for watching don't forget to smash the like button subscribe if you are new and I'll be happy to get you guys doing some adventure because as Nantic says adventure is out there bye guys